Just uh, the acoustics, can you remember to raise your voice a little bit for me? It's against the library policy, but I would like us to hear. No, just the kids did the announcements, made the four feet with you. Oh, that's fine. No, we're super busy. Sorry. I think maybe that's not good. That makes it really go fast. I feel like I just got the word I love. Lots of field trips. Lots of purchase orders. Get the summer school ready. Six o'clock, I'm going to call this meeting to order. Uh, we're doing a special meeting for at the Metroville Library for the just discuss the cans and bottles. Um, roll call. Helvey. Here. Butler. Kuska. Small. Or Heather. Everyone's present. Um, all stuff that is not here. Uh, do I have a motion to approve the consent agenda? I make a motion to approve the agenda. So moved. Motion moved and seconded. All in favor? Aye. Aye. Motion passed. So we're here to discuss the cans and bottle program. From what I'm gathering and what I've been finding out, we're having a lot of trouble getting volunteers to consistently step up and help sort. Um, we're having to pay Ellen overtime to do this and I don't know if this program is just going to be feasible to continue on doing it to be financially profitable for us. I know it's a lot of work on Ellen. It's a lot of stress on her to keep up with the bins on windy days when the bins are overflowing. Cans are blowing up you know, throughout the town, throughout on, on Main Street. We've got several complaints now. Um, one official, a couple emails, um, one called in just about that. It's making Main Street, you know, not look picked up, makes it look cluttered, you know, trash blown around. I feel that we should probably just do away with the can program and come up with other ways for fundraising. Any discussion? I did talk to Lion to see if they wanted to partner up so that would be fun and see if they would it because then we have less help. Lion just going to have this anyway. I was just supposed to call him when he's done with I didn't get that call last week. But yeah, they said uh, somebody could email that. I mean, and then we could move it in from here too. I think too, if, if we're going to do away with it, we need to offer it either to Parks and Rec. Or to the little league, let so them see if they the want Legion. it. If, if they want it, if, if Parks and Rec or the Lions want to deal with it, you know, that, that's completely on them. Yeah. They, they can deal with having to just to keep it here in the town because if it is a good fundraiser for Little League or the Parks and Rec, there was someone else too that approached me. 
So our official complaint form is from Bill Roberts. Uh, he just said bottle flush in the EMS center looks bad and needs removed. So. Um. Discussing about the um, cans of bottles, um, we're talking about just ending the program altogether. And just with all of the issues that we're having with having consistent volunteers, all the stress it puts on Ellen, having to take them into the redemption center all the time. That you know, there's there's other ways I feel that we can do our fundraising and still get that money coming in that we can use for for projects. And I mentioned maybe offering it to Parks and Rec or the Little League to kind of keep it in our town if someone would want to take it on. 4-H Club, somebody. Lions yeah, 4-H Legion. Club. I just think in more young, I think the Lions Club, I think all of them are elderly. But yeah, if they, but do, they need to make money too. But if they do have a place to take it, that'd be great too. Mm -hmm. Look at all the options, get the word out, and see what's doable for them. What do we do and are we making them deciding whether to do it or not do it or, and then decide whether to make a list of people that might take it on or what's what's we the would process just, there we would just decide that we wouldn't you know if if we decide not to do it anymore we wouldn't do it then we would leave it up to the other organizations if they want to step up and do it that's on them but the lions should have the first chance since they have this they used to help us a lot with cans right yeah yeah, yeah. Good sign. yeah. Okay, yeah. Good. so i i you know, so maybe we need to put together a list and then prioritize the list. Is that what you're thinking? Or well, just you know, put a notice out that hey, we're no longer collecting these, you know, at this time, and we'll, we'll pull the bins, we'll take care of what we have in there that's now, get that money, and then we'll get with Tammy, we'll see how much money's in our that we've raised from our cans, and put it in an account that we can use towards library improvements. It already is. It already is. Okay. It's already there. She's talking about account over there. You're talking about a separate account. Yes. We can't, we can't put them in a separate account. Okay. And it's it's already in the library account, so we can it can be used by the library anytime. Yes. Okay. So I have something to say. I was just watching this on film. And why would we give the cans to, to the Little League to, to, to have them do it? Because once again, Joan's going to be in charge of the, the pop cans. I want to keep it in town. But you know what? If you can't keep it at the library, why should we give it to Joan Alsop again to have control of the pop cans and then she's take for the Little League? Now the cans are You're not on the agenda, so. Really, you should. But you know what? Erin could talk during the meeting. Last she shouldn't time. have, though. Well, you guys let her do it, so I'm going to voice my, my I'm going to voice my opinion because I don't think it's right. I don't I mean, care. Who I don't, you know what? They're going to get rid of the uh, pocket. Okay, get them all. Okay. Get them all together. That, that's that's enough. That's, just get them all together. That, that's enough. Oh, that's just being wasteful. We're we're discussing the the, the library do, doing the cans. We're not discussing any other matter. Thank you for your concern, though. Okay, so back to our discussion. You know, we, we can reach out to the Lions first, tell them that, hey, we're not going to do this anymore. If you guys want to do it, feel free to. Then at that point, if other organizations want to do it, they can reach out to the people and let them know that, hey, they're collecting. But that way, it would be out of our, we wouldn't be doing it no more. And... I think that would alleviate a lot of the issues of just having to transport them, collect collect the money, keep track of all, all that stuff. You know, it's a lot less stress on you. We're not pay, having to pay you overtime. You don't have to take up your personal time in the evenings, on weekends, you know, doing it. Joan, I want to thank you for all the years that you spent doing this. Yeah. You're very welcome. I want to second that, too. Yeah, me too. So... So do we need a, are you looking for a motion? Yes. Okay. Can we get a, do we have a motion or how do you guys want to do this? Well, can I say something? I, I sure. think that's valid. 
that we can't find volunteers to help, that another volunteer group is going to step forward and take it on. Um, I do think that's a valid point. Like, if we could, if we, if we can't do it, get some cut of it, but like share of the lions. Yeah. I don't think they'd be willing to do that. They it's are. a dirty job. They are. They are. Okay. Try they to. talked about that when they called me to say they were going to start helping because they used to do that all the time. So they, they mentioned that amongst themselves. And then when I talked to them last night, she was going to email everybody. They'd be willing to check out. That's yeah, for sure. it'd be worth them saving something, but. Yeah. Did you want to discuss that? Well, I'm sorry. No, I just wanted to. Monday, I just Tuesday, Wednesday, Thursday, have the concern of other people yeah, that are. I, I can I can see her, her point as far as it's going to another group, but not, and it's going to be volunteer, but there's not volunteer. Like maybe people just aren't even aware. I don't know. I'm I agree. I but I, I agree. You're going to continue, though, to have the problems with volunteers and yeah. Okay. And it was a good thing going. And if, I don't know where all the information came about Joan, but it, we still have a good thing going. She was doing it for free. She had, um, she didn't charge no rent. I mean, I don't know how many years she did it, but she really, really had a good thing going. I think she did it for like 12 years. I, it was over 10. I don't have It was a long time. I don't remember. What did it average? And I appreciate it. It, it varied because when we first started out, we weren't collecting that many. It maybe be $100 every maybe month or two months. Mm -hmm. There just weren't that many of them, you know. And then as years went on, the program grew. And then when the COVID hit, it just exploded. Yeah, it exploded because, you know. You couldn't take it back any place. You know, Fairway and, and Hy-Vee, they didn't want to do it. They didn't, and people, they got accustomed to not having to take them back any place, and they liked not having to mess with them, and, They were know, doing so. good for the library, and. Unfortunately, I just, you know, I think the issue is just coming up with volunteers to help sort them, and it, 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 it's a lot more work than I, than I think what everyone realizes. Oh, yeah, it is. It is. I know. And one of the other problems is that all the bar owners found out mm -hmm. that oh. so they're dumping that. all the bottles mm -hmm. on there. We've and, got a and couple the bottles of, are terrible to work with. There's, they, there's a couple phone numbers that I've got probably somewhere still that were wanting to bring them directly. Instead, they didn't. We didn't want them putting them in here. Cause they would fill up those bins and then we here we are struggling with them they were going to bring them out to the farm but i said we can't we couldn't handle it right now so we told them no but if in the future we can we would call them so you know if if we get to the point where we can handle that we can call them and they were bars and he said he knew of other people other bars also that would be happy to bring them but we just couldn't handle it at that point. We just had our hands full. If so. we get to the point where we can find a place to store them and we have consistent people to do it, we can maybe revisit restarting this program. I just think for right now, it, you know, let's just discontinue it and we'll, we'll go from there. Yeah. Offer it to Lions or whoever. Yeah. Somebody wants to step up and. And if they get tired of it, they can offer it to yeah. someone else. Yeah. So. And we got all the bins and stuff. All we got to do is just change the sign. So, so what I. They'll have to. I'm sorry. Go ahead. So, what I think we should do is just pull the bins tonight. We'll take what we have. We'll get it sorted and get it turned in, and we'll note. We'll put notices up saying, "Hey, we're no longer accepting this," and you know, just for them to, you know, just say, "Hey, you're gonna, you know." There's other organizations out there that you can donate this to. I didn't think of that today, but I see that come out. I think I know they, so I mean maybe could we put um I'm trying to think. I don't know if there's a way we can put I mean Tammy can send something out, but if we could set something out that it said we are 
no longer collecting them, but we are looking for another organization that would like to take this over. Yeah. Yeah. They're still so going to throw it in there until well, we get rid well, of them. That's why turn we them upside down. Yeah. Turn well, the bins upside we'll down and put a note on down. them that says... Did they pass any more? No. Mm -hmm. yeah. Turn them upside down. Does that make sense? Yep. Yeah. So, do we have a motion to discontinue the can program? I make a motion to discontinue the program. I second it. So, motion has been seconded. Um, all in favor? Aye. Aye. Motion passed unanimously. We are now officially done doing the CAM program and we, are, we, are, we will pull the bins. Okay. I have a motion to adjourn the meeting. Motion to adjourn. Can, can we back up a little bit? Yes. What, what's the process that we're going to do? Are we going to offer it first to the Lions and then if they decide not to, then we come up with a list of potentials? And then we maybe prior prioritize who we would like to see. I mean, how do you want to do it? I don't know. I think you I'm asking come up with a question. List. I think well, whoever wants it comes yeah, and gets it. Yeah, whoever, whoever <laughs> wants it comes and gets it. You know, we can offer to the line saying, hey, we're no, we're no longer going to do this. You know, but at that point, it's up to the <laughs> people that were donating to find a place to, to take them. Because actually, there could be three different people take a bin. Are you planning on leaving the bins on city property for? A non-city function. Miss Todd anymore to do it. Whoever takes it will have to deal with that. We'll have to move the bins. Mm -hmm. yep. Yeah, that's what. It, if you're doing I just it want to make sure if the library is still doing it in conjunction with the library, then you still have to. We're still responsible for those bins wherever they go. If we, if we are doing it in conjunction with lines, right? Or am I confused? But I don't think you said we're doing it with the lines, did you guys? We can offer it to the lines, see if they want to do it. But as far By as yourself. as okay. far as the library is concerned, okay, we can we can get rid of the bins, <coughs> remove them off the property, and be done with it. Okay. Is there any concern that we should address if Kansas City Community or Baldos without the bins there, like, or do we not have a protocol in place for that? Just wait you get them right until I get rid of them. Are you worried that's going to happen? Oh yeah, it will happen. It'll happen. It'll happen at first, but once we get the word out and tell people that we're no longer accepting them, then... Okay. I'll just carefully get the cans can, out. Can you send something out tomorrow, Carol? Yeah. Do we want her to send something out? Yes, send, mm -hmm. have yeah. her send something out, and then Ellen can share on Facebook. Mm -hmm. That's a really good way to reach people. Yeah. And I'll let the Lions know you're going to do them first, but... Yep. Okay. So, can I get a motion to adjourn the meeting? All in favor? Aye. Aye. Uh, meeting adjourned at 616. I have an odd question not related to this. <laughs> yeah, this is good.